VSAT. VSAT is an acronym and it stands for Very Small Aperture Terminal. What it means is uh, the terminal itself is anywhere from 0.74, perhaps even 0.6 meters up to 2.4 meters. The, this is important because the smaller a VSAT uh, reflector is, then the more easier and more cost effective it is to install in locations, including people's houses as well as businesses. A VSAT terminal is a very simple device. It really only consists of two components. There's an outdoor unit and an indoor unit. The outdoor unit consists of the reflector, which as I mentioned is anywhere from 0.6 meters, 0.74 meters, up to 2.4 meters. Uh, the reflector plus the outdoor electronics, which consists of the uh, power amplifier and the low noise block converter. These are the elements which go into the transceiver. The outdoor unit is connected to the indoor unit via an IFL, an intra-facility link, which is typically a coax cable, perhaps one cable or two cables. The IFL connects to an indoor unit, which is typically a fairly small device, generally about the size of a PC. And the indoor unit is really two elements. One is a satellite modem, and the second is an IP router. The indoor unit typically has an ethernet interface, which connects to the local area network at the remote location. And the purpose of the indoor unit is to facilitate communications over the satellite.